Hello everyone, this is Boricua Binks and welcome back to Let's Play Nameless, the one thing you must recall. As always, I'm joined by Coco. Say hello. Hello everyone. Last time, let's see, last time we actually had a rather interesting scene in which we were seeing things through the perspective of Tay and Red. One of them, the first one was a girl asked Tay to the roof so that she could confess to him. And when she did, he asked what it was about him that she liked. And she pretty much just said that it was love at first sight. So he understood that it wasn't really anything substantial, that she only liked him for his looks. Mm. And despite that, he still let her down gently. Mm. And, you know, she understood. But then <laughs> immediately after running into Red, who was like, you know, just being considerate of her, she started crushing on him. <laughs> <laughs> who could so, blame um, her? <laughs> fair, fair. He was being very, very uh, gentlemanly. <laughs> And then um, earlier, Tay had told Jackie about how he was going to start working at Bonzo and invited her over. And she had been intended to go over there with Soy and Shinbi, but then Shinbi had to leave for a photo shoot and she didn't want to take just Soy, probably because of uh, nerves of her uh, moving in on Tay. Mm -hmm. And so then afterwards, back when she was at home and writing in her diary, uh, Tate brought her some of the sleepy time tea, but there was a weird thing going on where he was asking her about her journal and like, how can you read that? Mm -hmm. But they didn't really make clear what they meant by that, like if it was really messy or what. It seemed like there was something more going on there. Yeah, almost like she was writing in like a different language or something. <laughs> Maybe, yeah. Ah, I want to know so bad. Oh. Okay, so actually let's continue on because I just remembered something that Coco and I discovered after we finished recording last time. All right. Okay, so this is the new chapter. Banjul again. Yes, again for us, but not again for them. <laughs> <laughs> oh, creepy dude. Wake up, Miss Sleepyhead. Um. Ah, uh, that was not Tay's voice, but okay. <laughs> <laughs> Again, it was Tay's voice that woke me up today. Unless it is Tay all along, I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> this game has me so thrown off. I love it. <laughs> <laughs> I barely opened my eyes and said good morning. Tay's smile still looked blurry. Um... Oh, Tay, hey. You're awake. <laughs> you still look like you're sleepy. Nah, I'm not. I'm awake. Unfortunately. Mm, girl, I feel you. <laughs> it's weird because even though I'm able to sleep in a little more now that I'm working from home, I'm ruining it by going to bed later. So it's like <laughs> <laughs> the same struggle in the morning. I'm like, no. <laughs> ah, when will I learn? No, you're not. Here, take my hand. I'll help you get up. You know, I was editing the first episode of Tay's Route, and I saw back the whole thing with him helping her walk and go to the bathroom and him having a pee kink. <laughs> and I was oh god, like, I forgot about that. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm just like, oh no, here we go again. <laughs> Tay reached out his hand, and before I could hold on to it properly, he grabbed me and sat me upright. Is she becoming like a doll or something now? Like, what the heck? Ooh, Ooh that's a good that's, theory. That's, <laughs> that, that's, that's, that's something I found out um, 
a while back. That's that's a kink for some people. E <laughs> it's it's I I mean it's like you know, to each their own. But I'm just like, hmm, don't understand. So like, okay, maybe off recording you have to explain <laughs> this to me. <laughs> Sorry, viewers, you'll never find out. <laughs> Or just Google it, I don't know. Oh, no. Or, <laughs> You'll probably yeah. find really weird shit. <laughs> <laughs> yes, go to the dark side of the internet. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a bad influence, okay. <laughs> I felt dizzy from suddenly sitting up. Yeah, that ain't normal, girl. You have, like, blo low blood sugar or something? Too much ramen. <laughs> oh, wow, you're, you're so cruel. You came to wake me up today? Yeah. Why? You're disappointed Yonho didn't come. No. Oh. What? What does yawning have to do with being a joker? <laughs> <laughs> You'll become the joker if you yawn like that. You'll feel better after you wash your face. Yes, you're totally gonna go and fight Batman. <laughs> <laughs> then I'll go and prepare breakfast. Don't go back in bed, alright? Okay. I stretched my arm, but I couldn't stop yawning. Dang it, game, don't make yawn. Coco yawn. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm just looking this. We're talking about how sleepy I am. Mm. And now. Uh, so sleepy. Dang it. As I dozed off, even while sitting up straight. Tay didn't leave and kept watching me with suspicion. I can't trust you. Yeah, we can't trust you either. <laughs> I'm not going back to sleep, I swear. Alright, alright. Then get ready and come out. Okay. I spaced out at the door. Tay had Tay just closed. For some reason, I can't focus very well and felt dazed. And I feel sluggish for some reason. Yeah, that's uh, not good. This is really making me worry for her. Mm-hmm. Like even more so than the weird stuff going on with the diary and the memories. Yeah. The tea Tay gave me must have done its job really well. Oh, yeah, he must have drugged her. <laughs> I felt not only relaxed, but also as if all my energy was sucked out. No, actually, I've been feeling like this every morning these days. Since Tay's been bringing these every night. Mm. I don't like this. Yeah. Let's get up. Uh huh. A text. I grabbed my phone from the bedside table. It's from Soy. Did you hear? He's been working at Sanduo. We have to go there today. Ermagerd! <laughs> I forgot she does that. The Ermagerd! <laughs> yes, that's right. I love her. <laughs> okay. I can just feel her excitement from the text. She'll probably be hyper in the classroom. He already knows. It hasn't even been a week since Tay started working. But since Soy figured it out already, 
All the girls will soon know too. I'm worried. I hope his followers don't bother him at work. No. I guess his fans who go to the cafe to see him will help the business there. It would suck to be harassed at work. Yep. Well, I guess it won't be any harm to Tay. Gosh, imagine if it's as bad as what Kyohei goes through and... I was, yeah, I was just thinking about that. Yeah. I decided to think positively. Tay is always careful and takes care of himself well, so there won't be any need to worry. And I guess it's good. I was going to take them to the cafe soon, so they would have found out anyways. I should go to that cafe called Bantul this afternoon with Soy and Chindi. So, I'm going to be the lead. Oh, you got up. Good morning. Hey, good morning. Ray was talking excitedly about something when he stopped to say good morning. What were you talking so excitedly about? I've been cast as the lead of the drama club's play. So I was telling everyone how awesome my role is. Ahem. It's so cool. A justice warrior fighting against evil to defend the world. It's as if the play was made especially for Red. <laughs> Yonho sparkled his eyes and said. Red shrugged his shoulders to hear that. To hear that. <laughs> I know, right? I was meant to do this. I never expected to run into the person who is similar to you. It is indeed a large world. A large and unfortunate world. <laughs> Lance said and sighed and said. I miss Lance. Me too. Every time I see him, I'm like, oh. <laughs> I'm sure we'll see lots of him in Red's route. <laughs> yeah, I hope so. Why don't you just be honest and say you're jealous? Well. I guess no one would ever ask you to be in a play like this. I would refuse even if someone does ask. And for the record, I have been. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I still wish they had shown us. Yeah. <laughs> Just imagining him in the dress and having to kiss Red. Yes. <laughs> Today, I won't be bothered by anything you say. Red and Lance start bickering again, like an old married couple. <laughs> I never imagined that this would be how I realized another day had started. Huh. That is how much they fought in the morning. Aren't you too even exhausted? I send my condolences to my eyes for having to see you boys fight as soon as we see the light. Yuri arrived just in time and scolded them. Or actually, he did for them. <laughs> Good morning, Yuri. 
My honey, look tight, that's so. Hey, kiddo. Did my honey sleep well, too? Wait, are you talking to Jackie or, or Yono? Yeah. Hmm. New ship? Weird <laughs> ship? Like, really weird, weird ship? <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if I'm into it. Mm. Yono deserves better. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> he may be a Yandere, but he, even he deserves better. <laughs> Yeah, how about you? Ah, so he totally ignored Yono's greeting and was talking to her. <laughs> Rude. No. Long night was too lonely. Aw, the te ignore you. <laughs> Yuri, Yuri slithered towards me like a serpent and told me. <laughs> I love the voice acting. <laughs> yes. Well, oh, thank my honey. If you're worried about me, why don't you spend a passionate night? Ow! <laughs> Lance to the rescue? Yep. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> With the chakla, always! <laughs> the slipper flew, flew through the air and exactly hit Yuri's head. And as always, Lance stood where the slipper came from by a complete and utter coincidence. <laughs> he really was up to his name, Lancelot the Knight. <laughs> he was barefoot on one foot. But his eyes that were treating Yuri like a vermin were as cold as ever. You never learn, do you? Nope. <laughs> I would like to be known for my perseverance. I don't know about perseverance, but I get that you're stubborn. Why don't you just sit down? Hmm. <laughs> you're such a mom, Tay. Yuri grumbled at what Tay said, but he quietly sat beside Lance. As Yuri sat by him, Lance backed away a bit. He obviously still didn't want to deal with him. Anyways, the story got off track, but I'll come home late from now on <laughs> since I have rehearsals. Days late because of work, and Red too. The house will become more quiet now. Yunho looked a bit, bit sad. He must have told everyone about his job. Actually, I quite look forward to the silence. Of course, it would be best if just one more person would come late. No, actually, not to come at all. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? I did not. Lance stopped staring at Yuri and replied coldly. My honey, I'm not going to until my honey is gone, I will never leave this house. 그렇게 말하는 사람 치고는 요즘 들어 귀가가 늦던데 도대체 나가서 뭘 하고 돌아다니는 거야? Speaking of which, I think you've been coming home too late these days. What do you do outside, anyways? 어른의 사정이지. 지나친 호기심은 고양이를 죽인다잖아. 
<laughs> it's adult stuff. They say curious, curious kitties get killed, don't they? So no more. Yuri winked and gave us a sneaky smile. Ugh, I don't even want to know. Nope. I feel like I'll become that dead kitty. I ignored his <laughs> wink and talked to Tay. Oh, that's, that's right. That reminds me. Can I go to your cafe today? Today? Yeah, I think my friends will have time. Of course, any time is great. Tay smiled happily. She better actually show up this time. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's the brightest smile I've seen from him recently. Was he disappointed that I didn't go the first day? Yep. He came into your room all creepy-like, too. <laughs> you must have liked the cafe. Uh-huh. I've never been there. How would I like it or not like? Uh-oh. I felt confused, but Donald pulled at my clothes and whined. <laughs> I want to go too. Really? Then let's go together. Today, <laughs> master. Okay, master. <laughs> I think you have cleaning duties today. Oh. Yonho quickly hardened his heat smiling face and pouted. Come to think of it, Yonho had cleaning duties this whole week. Aw, poor Yonho. Disregarding your duties to give play is a very poor attitude. Playing hooky is bad, don't you think? You know, now that I think about it, is it only in like Asian countries where they actually have cleaning duties and stuff like that? Um. I... I don't think so. Like, I remember my elementary school, and like, part of middle school. No, it was just elementary, we would sometimes, like, have it, but it wouldn't be a thing where, like, someone would have to stay after school. Mm hmm You know, like, the time during actual school hours for it. Huh. I never had that. <laughs> I guess I was lucky. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, the only thing I can remember is, like, in elementary school when we had a pet we had to take care of, like, box turtles. Oh, I never, that I never did. <laughs> I would have preferred that. Hmm. Yeah, we had a snake. A little tiny cute snake in first Aww. grade. Box turtles in second grade? And then I think we also had hermit crabs, but I don't remember what year. Yeah. Lance thrust a dagger into Yon Ho's heart, literally. Oh no. <laughs> Lance, no! <laughs> At least do it to Yuri. <laughs> He's being harsher than usual today. I heard the government's been really busy. Lance must be stressed out too. I know she means student government, but I'm imagining that Lance is actually <laughs> with the government. <laughs> yes. Uh, master, sorry. I don't think I can make it. Plotting to get Lance back. <laughs> There are still a lot of chances, so we can go next time. 
Master, okay, we'll go together next time. You won't become a bad student for missing your cleaning duties once, but you should do your best at what you've been assigned to do. When you come, I'll make sure to bring you cake, so cheer up. Wow, really? Okay, thanks. Now, let's stop the mushiness here and have breakfast. Eating meals regularly is crucial for your skin. Marie taps his water glass like a cake. 식사 준비는 한 번도 도와주지 않은 사람이 제일 거드름을 피우는군. 알았어. 잠시만 기다려. You haven't helped a single bit to prepare the meal, and you're the loudest. All right. Wait a moment. Hey, soon brought out the food. After noisily finishing our meals, we took the limo and again made a fuss at school. Oh. <laughs> My baby. And here I was just thinking. Yeah, we haven't seen him in so long. <laughs> he was summoned by your 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 call. <laughs> Alrighty. So actually, before we end the episode right here, guys, I wanted to show you what Coco and I discovered last time, which is we haven't looked at this diary in a while. Um. But what freaked us out was seeing these ripped out pages. Which I believe she kind of alluded to. That she was like, what the heck is going on? Yeah, she did. But the diary pretty much is just talking about her daily life. Um, but it seems like a lot of information is missing. Because we're jumping in time. Uh, about, you know, when the dolls became human and Yonho not waking her up anymore because Tay's waking her up. And then there's like a bunch of missing stuff. So we thought that was interesting. Yeah. Okay, but that will be it for today. So, let's see here again. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this. And until next time, have a nice day. Toodaloo. Thanks for watching! If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already! And also make sure to ring the bell for notifications for new episodes! You can follow me on Twitch where I stream every week and also follow me on Twitter for updates! Until next time, have a nice day! Adios!